What's going on everybody, it's Super Robot Ed, and today I got some disappointing news about the Amazon Wreckers uh, repaint set. So it was revealed on yesterday, May 11th, 2022. As of the time I am recording this video at 10.23 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on May the 12th, 2022. The pictures of Legacy Wreck and Rule Diaclone Color Twin Twist were shown on the official Hasbro Instagram and then taken down. Now, so far it has been reported from a lot of people who have inside knowledge that there is no top speed. And if there was, I think the leakers would have gotten it by now. So I'm on the, I'm not even on the fence to say this is the last one in the set unless they have a fossilizer to go with them. Um, this is it. So we'll talk about Twin Twist and of course, this is one of the best of the best of the Titans Return. Um, hands down, the price of this figure and the original colors are ridiculously high. Um, so definitely if you have the money, you might want to get this one unless you really have the money to spend to get the original, which he can go upwards of over $150 loose and in card and on card. Excuse me. So let's talk about the set overall. Now, I had some hopes, you know, because I was like, hey, they're going to give us this BAF hammer. This BAF hammer, we thought it would be plastic parts, but it's been confirmed the parts are cardboard. So in essence, you're going to try to scramble to get all five sets for five pieces of cardboard. What a shame. Shame on Amazon. Shame on Hasbro. You know, the prices aren't bad. What we're getting in the sets aren't bad. Mainly the Impactor and the Leadfoot set coming with those fossilizers, you know, as a bonus, but the Impactor itself, I don't like. I prefer the three pack, Am the Amazon three pack Impactor that came with the clear uh, Mirage and the, uh, I guess it was like the other red repaint of Call. As far as the Springer, eh, I don't care for the G1 toy colors. I prefer the Siege version. And if you get like, I think it's the second release of him, 70% alcohol will get the that silver grime off. And I'll, I'll take a, I'll post a video on that one day, but it's not right now. The lead foot, yeah, I, I kind of dig it, but then again, I don't dig it because the Kingdom Raj Road is mold is just a very kind of upsetting mold because it doesn't have the shoulder cannon. I would have preferred, since you can't mount these guns on his shoulder, the day I probably gave them the rotor weapons that comes with the original G2 lead foot. The bulkhead is a no. I don't like the original. I don't like this one. Um, Twin Twist I might buy just because I like the mold itself. And I think that it's a great mold. You know, even though it doesn't have the modern articulation, it's still molly whips a lot of what's been put out over the years. Um, you know, beyond what has come out for that figure. So at the end of the day, we know they're not going to get another Twin Twist or a Top Spin. So you better go and get that one. If you're looking for a Ruination, I mean, well, record set, go for Ruination. I don't know how much this costs. I owned this set way back in 2012, um, 2013, when they had the uh, Fall of Cybertron Bruticus repaints, and, you know, and they released these. The cool thing about these, they gave us new remolded parts and colors. And not only that, they gave us extra weapons, actual weapons that the characters could hold. And then these weapons could form into a super weapon. And you have five characters that can form into a robot. It's not the greatest of a combiner, but it's decent. It, it actually is, you know, the precursor to me, Combiner Wars. But I really did dig this set because of what they did. This is what you call repaint and remolding gun, right? And the price was the same. You got, and you got extra weapons. It was a nice set. Very nice set. And this is the old Hasbro, you know, where we, you know, yeah, Hasbro had its issues even back then, but at least they gave us more. And with TRU on the scene, you got the set for under retail. You could go into, you know, hit a TRU early in the morning and they have the buy two, get one free sale. You could buy this. It's only five, but you could buy like another figure that you might have missed during the fall of Cybertron days and you would come out very good. And yes, when I sold this, I made a pretty penny because I kept it in mint condition. But now seeing that we're getting this 
lackluster set from Amazon, I wish I kept this set. Now, naturally, for a lot of people, they're going to say, well, you know, it doesn't have the modern articulation. I don't care about articulation. I just care about certain things that we're not getting these days. And just knowing we're getting cardboard, it, it just, just, that's unsettling. Um, so overall with this set, I have to say that the entirety of the set is very lackluster. Um, I really wish they would have given us something to maybe really get out and get this. Like, yes, let's give us plastic parts to create the BF hammer. It would have been perfect. You can put the hammer in somebody, you know, one of your larger Titan figures or, you know, one of the large leader figures. I mean, that's cardboard. So we're paying for cardboard, but that's just, oh my gosh, man, it's, it's, it's horrible. And I'm really disappointed with these repaints. I mean, after a while, you got to just say, hey, let's do something else besides repaint and remold. It's just, you know, like I said, comparative to repaints that we got in earlier lines, you know, it just feels, it just feels like it's just lackluster. That's the word I use, just lackluster. It feels tacky, trashy, and cheap. And it's just a way to suck our money. I mean, literally, Bulkhead just came out. And now we got to repaint him in this been less than... I know he's been on the scene because the leakers had him, but it's only been a few months. And we've already got a slightly different repaint, which all, to me, try to look like the Age of Extinction out. I, I just feel like as collectors, we're being duped. I think we're being stumped. And with this Amazon set, it's, it's just... Hmm, it's very disappointing. So... Save your money, put it towards somewhere else. Something else. Well, my name is Super Robot Ed. We'll see you soon. Let's hope we get some better news tomorrow. Bye bye.